Breaking family, we got a chase pack. So there's been recordings of a new Pokemon card display at Walgreens. And there's new Pokemon mystery packs in that display with a chance at a vintage pack of Pokemon cards. Positive vibes to you. Let's go. Let's head inside and see if we can't find these mystery packs. This is a Walgreens we actually never, ever go to. I feel like the display would be up front somewhere. Okay, let's at least check down this aisle. Yeah, let's check down this aisle at least. They could take the stuff off the display and put it on the little pegs, but it doesn't look like, I mean, oh, they do have some Pokemon cards. Look, they have the nice Mimikyu tin over here. Oh, wait, wait. Did, did you find it? Oh no, they're all gone. So the mystery blister and every single one of them is gone. We got here too late. We're not gonna give up though. We're not gonna give up. We're gonna keep looking. Fusion Strike and Silver Tempest two pack right here. This, I kind of want this <laughs> because there's most likely evolving skies in here. Honestly, I gotta say that was that was smart because I never would have thought to like look around the corner. Yeah, take that extra step. Can we put a gold star up there? You know, one of those ones that you get on the paper. There's... No success yet. However, we do got 110 and look at this. Today's enemy is across the street, right over there. CVS, the enemy today. Second Walgreens stop and we're in a location that we usually, we'll usually go to this one every once in a while. We're looking for the mystery packs. Marie, Yes. do you think this is the one that Absolutely. has the mystery packs? They're new mystery packs. I think they have like a fossil pack on the front of them, which nobody's gonna pull any fossil packs, no. but you never know. Now there's usually displays down here. Wait, 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 wait. You go straight to Oh, look at this. Look at this fresh display right here. Oh, is this a new mystery box? Four, four pack power box. Okay, so this one doesn't have a, ch you're laying out your hands because you yeah. know. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're gonna do, I just put it in my hand. <laughs> so this one's actually not a mystery box right here. This one's just four packs. Okay. So, I mean, that's not, not too bad, I guess. $24, depending on what the pack selection is. However, this is what we are looking for right here. Look for vintage packs. It includes one booster pack, one foil card, and one code card to look for chase packs. Of course, it doesn't tell us what the chase packs could possibly be. What is this? This is, um, oh, it's, a, it's like a three pack. Yeah, so these are like three packs. However, neither of these are packaged by the Pokemon Company International. So um, they are packaged by the third party company that uh, packages those. This, however, is packaged by the Pokemon Company International. Oh, yes. Oh, you didn't say we were buying. I thought you just wanted to find them. We found them. Let's go. No, 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 no. no. $9.99 here. So $10 for one pack. And this could literally be Scarlet and Violet could base be set. Could be nothing. Could be, could be battle styles. You should get them all. Eight in a row right there. Okay. So, mm, dude, here, I'm gonna hand that to you. Oh, look, my I'm hand. confused about what I wanna do here. I'm gonna do the last two. Of each row? Of each row. I know what's going on, okay? I don't think you are. I'm, I'm, I'm not crazy. I don't think you got I'm this. not crazy. I know exactly what's going on here. And you're saying in the middle? Yeah. Okay, so we'll grab one from the middle. Okay. Boom, right here. So these three on top will be from the middle. Yeah. Middle, right there. Okay, so these three on top right here are from the middle. Should we do the. Yeah, just mark it so we know. There uh, you a, go. Little, a little rip so we know which which ones are from the middle. Okay. So you're saying those like are from it. the middle. Yep. We have a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's more than I want. <laughs> but you know what, let's go ahead and just for like research purposes, let's get one of these and just see what pack selection comes inside. So that way, if you're wondering what could possibly come inside of this, we can have some knowledge based around this. We got you covered. Oh, we got them. We got them right here. We can I, stop looking at all the Walgreens now. We went yes. to one other location. We found them like right, I guess, uh, fresh, like a fresh display, Walgreens Pokemon <laughs> card display. And uh, it was nice to have a fresh one because usually when I find them, they're not really that fresh, like right out of the oven fresh. One thing though that I do want to point out is that there is another CVS right across the street. And last week we were focusing on CVS and we stopped at Walgreens. Marie locked me out. We bought two things at the Walgreens to see if those two things could be better than 20 packs at CVS and Walgreens ended up winning. It was craziest thing ever. It was the old mystery packs. We pulled a 10 year old pack from it. And so Walgreens won from just two packs versus CVS with 20 packs. What if we reverse it now? What if we go to that CVS, see if they have any Pokemon cards <laughs> oh and see if goodness. CVS can win with just like one or two packs uh, versus all the Walgreens. Why not? Let's try it. All right, I wanna, let me close the door before you take off here. Okay, we were just over there. 
there was the Walgreens right over there. And now we're at CVS to see if they have anything. We had good luck with CVS last week. So I'm assuming there's gonna be something inside of here, but we haven't, I don't think I've ever been into this CVS, honestly. Been a long time. You grew up in this area, weird. so. This is weird. Is this where they, they print off the million, million coupons in the, the long, Would you like some the coupons? long receipt? Oh, wait, is there free coupons there? Coupons? Maybelline, Revlon, and nail polish. All right, I'm gonna leave that. <laughs> Marie, you look like you're having a great time just exploring at this point right now. It's weird. <laughs> Is it weird? It's weird. <laughs> okay, I don't see any Pokemon over here, but there should be another section and then also checking behind the register as well. Where do we go? Where are you looking for? We gotta look for the section where the other Pokemon stuff would be. I think we need to go back this way. Oh, right here, look, boom, here we go. A little Charmander right here. Here is some Pokemon cards. However, those are not gonna be ones that we're interested in. Honestly, I bet we need to check behind the register. I feel like that's what's gonna be. <laughs> you get distracted by the mini brands? I don't have a problem, I have a problem. Oh, now wait a minute, candy. Last week I said I should do a pure just Reese's video where I buy everything Reese's out there that exists. And I just try it all in one video. I think everybody's on board with this. Okay. Are you on board? Go for it. Oh, just think of everything that we could get. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Now these. Uh, yeah, look at them. So now much. Them. So much. But no, none of the none of the pink hearts. We can't find the pink hearts anywhere. All right, let's see if there's any Pokemon cards behind the register. I guess we can ask somebody. Okay, I'm gonna find somebody. Anybody? anybody? Am I alone in the CPS? <laughs> Is it just me in here? Excuse me. Yes. You don't happen to have any Pokemon cards behind the register, do you? Was. Pokemon cards? Let me check. Okay, thank you. Okay, so they did have these by the register. However, I'm gonna pass on these because this is, yeah, CVS will not stand a chance <laughs> if I buy these. So we might have to find another CVS. One thing I would like to point out that while we are filming this right now at this very moment, I think probably if I can get a timestamp, 7.56, it was on a Sunday, uh, February 11th. So that means Super Bowl's going on right now. <laughs> and we have chosen Pokemon over the Super Bowl. And it always will be Pokemon over the Super Bowl. Oh, it's dark now. Door closed. All right, we're gonna turn some music on. We were listening to Alkaline Trio's new album. Uh -huh. All right, all right. So we're gonna keep rocking Alkaline Trio as we find another CVS somewhere. Do you know where one's at? Yeah. Okay, so we're not sure if this uh, CVS is open here, so Marie is making me get out and uh, check really, really fast. Is it open? It is open. So I think I've been inside of this CVS one time before a long, long time ago, but if you wanna see the area that it's kind of in, there's a library over there, oh. Hardee's, which is also a Carl's Jr. You remember when this didn't exist? I do. It is kind of dark over here. Got an interesting layout. It almost looks like a warehouse. <laughs> What kind of layout is this? Okay, this might be an area we can check right here. Yeah, I'm gonna check right down here just to make sure. There's probably not gonna be any Pokemon cards in this area over here, but it is worth just taking a quick look. I don't see anything, but if I, if I miss anything, make sure you all let me know down in the comments. I got distracted by whatever this is. Oh, did Marie just, just abandon me? <laughs> I, think, I think Marie abandoned me. Oh, wait, Hi. there you are. <laughs> did you find it? Nope. Oh, you didn't find it? Oh, wait, there you go. There, you found it. Okay, okay. All the way down here. We just gotta find some Pokemon cards at a CVS. Do they not have any either? Okay, they got Charmander. They got Horsey and a Squirtle back there. That's it. No, nothing else, really? Excuse me. Yeah. Can we get some Pokemon cards behind the register, please? Yeah, right there. Yeah, yeah, that one, please. <laughs> Thank you. I got them. Includes one booster pack and one foil card. They both are Scarlet and Violet base set. However, that doesn't mean that CVS can't win. CVS could still win because we have no idea what's inside those mystery packs. So can two CVS packs win over Walgreens is what? 15-ish packs? Honestly, <laughs> CVS, I don't, I don't think you got a chance, <laughs> my friend. Here is our Pokemon card haul. Let's see what's inside. What is up, my breaking family? Send in some positive vibes in your direction. Diving right into today's Pokemon card opening, starting off with the new Walgreens Pokemon mystery packs. Obviously you saw they're in a big display. Make sure you check all around your Walgreens. If this is something you're interested in, $9.99, whoo! 
That's a little rough. I feel dirty. I feel dirty that I bought all of these, but I had to breaking family. I had to for you so you can figure out what is inside of these, what you could potentially pull inside of these. But I feel like I do need to take a little bit of a shower after today's Pokemon card opening because I feel, I feel disgusting buying some of these Pokemon mystery packs. I'm not gonna lie, Breaking Family. These are packaged by a third party company. These are not packaged by the Pokemon Company International. It does say look for vintage packs. However, it does not tell us what pack could potentially be inside of it. One bonus pack, one foil card, and a one code card B booster pack, not bonus pack. Look for chase packs seated one out of every 10. That doesn't mean if you buy 10 that you're guaranteed one. Ugh. All right, so let's see. First off, now this is not the one that Marie picked out. She said the middle ones. I said no, it's the end ones. I know, I know where it's at, okay? Okay, I'm a pro with this. 10 years, 10 years here on YouTube. And Silver Tempest is the first one. Now the code card is going to be a Sword and Shield Darkness Ablaze. And then the foil card, Celebrations, okay. If you're looking for some celebrations, probably not the best route to go to get some. <laughs> it's gonna be cheaper to probably just buy a pack of celebrations. All right, Silver Tempest, let's see what we got inside of today's Pokemon card opening. Now we do have a total of nine Walgreens Pokemon mystery packs. Fly away to open up in today's video. We also got that 10. We also got this uh, four pack power box thing right here. Energy, and then the two packs from CVS to see if CVS can actually stand a chance against Walgreens, much like we did with uh, the video last week when we ran, went around to all the CVS. However, spoiler alert for that video, we ended up pulling a 10 year old pack in the, the older mystery packs and, and Walgreens won. So next one, Lost Origin. We're still on the stack that, uh, that I picked out here. So, you know, two packs in, you let me know what you think. For $9, I literally just spent $9 for a Reverse Holo Lombre, a, a Champion's Path Hatterene V collection uh, code card, or collection box code card, and a Lost Origin booster pack. Maybe two showers after today's Pokemon opening. <laughs> There's the code card right there. Better me than you to spend the money to figure out what's inside. Let me make the mistakes first, and then you can figure out what to do from there on out. Definitely three showers. We're up to three showers today, Breaking Family. I know, you've put in what, 28 years of hard work and then Ducklet waddles in, tries to steal your spotlight. Uh-uh, not on your watch. No, I'm right there with you, trust me, trust me. We got energy put in the filing cabinet, lost vacuum, going into a Mimikyu, and a Rhyperior. But what I always say when it comes to these third-party products, or any any product really, it's your money. Do whatever you want with it, all right? Who am I to tell you what to do with your money? I would suggest maybe so far from what we've seen, not do this, but... <laughs> Do whatever you want, all right? If you enjoy these, there's nothing wrong with that at all, okay? It's your money. Have fun with it, all right? Uh, we got a Houndstone right there, which is just, uh, it's from the collection box. It's from, <laughs> that's it. It's from that Greebird collection box. So, um, it's a, that's a common, by the way. That's a common. That's not a rare or anything. So, don't get too excited there. We got Lost Origin for another pack. So, so far, all we've seen is Lost Origin and Silver Tempest. That's it. That's it. We haven't even seen a Hollow Rare pull yet. So, Jinx going into Inke. Hang on, let me turn that upside down and just let me check and see. No, nope, no Malamars anywhere. All right, we got Paris, Zora, Energy. Put it in the filing cabinet. Roserade, Komala, right on. Oh, there we go. First Hollow Rare, we'll take it. Hollow Beauty Fly, right there. A stoked straw. I'm stoked that we could potentially pull something, but most likely not. We're up to three showers, by the way. Anybody that's keeping track here. Three showers. Who do you think is going to win today? You think it's going to be Walgreens or CVS? Let me know down in the comment section. I want to try to reply to as many comments as humanly possible. And we got a Lilligant right there. And that's actually from Guardians Rising. If you look down there, there's the symbol. Interesting. And at the code card, we got a Tornadus, Thunderous, and Landorus two-pack blister. So the code card's all over the place. Evolving Skies. I'm not going to complain about that. However, still, 
$9 for a pack of Evolving Skies is kind of rough, but it is nice to know that at least maybe one of the more sought after packs of Pokemon cards is a potential inside of the Walgreens Pokemon card mystery packs. We got ourselves a Pumpkaboo, Rufflet, going into a Lotan, a Molga, Woo Bat, Energy. Put it in the filing cabinet right over there. Ice Q, let me ice Q a question. Did I make a mistake today because I feel like I did? <laughs> Skip Bloom. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe there's not a mistake going on here. We got ourselves a Gyarados V, our first ultra rare pull for today's Pokemon opening. Whoop! Right up there in the VIP section, the very important Pokemon card section, which means we can officially add the VIP ropes with the all you can eat. Bagel bites, that's right, the all you can eat bagel bites, that's always here in the VIP section, sausage, pepper, and combination, cheese, that's it, that's all, nothing else. Uh, whew, so close, I almost stumbled on myself there. <sighs> so close. <laughs> that's it, that's all, nothing else. Grab yourself a paper plate, your VIP as well. Going into the next one, Breaking Family, no vintage pack. I don't know if that's considered a chase pack. It doesn't say on there. We have a, another of the same one, and we have a Cacturn. Interesting. That is from the, the Breakpoint set from back in the XY era. And our pack is a Scarlet and Violet base set. I mean, Evolving Sky is probably the best one we've pulled so far, and the only one that has actually had an Ultra Rare inside of it, so... Interesting, interesting to think about. We have a watch roll, fly away bird. Going into a manky, I'm gonna turn into an annihilate. If I, uh, if, can we can we turn the screen red like I'm angry? Urgh! You never know what's gonna happen, all right? The screen's just gonna turn red and you see steam coming off of me. We got Torkoal, I'm gonna turn into a, an annihilate if uh, if we don't get a chase pack in here. We got Cyclozar and our Balava Energy filing cabinet right over there. Now this is the last one that I picked out and then after this one the next three are the ones that Marie picked out. So keep in mind, keep in mind, all of these came from the very back of the uh, Walgreens Pokemon card display and then Marie decided the middle was the best one. Oh wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Now if I don't know any better, Breaking Family, I think we pulled a chase pack right here. If I, if my Pokemon knowledge serves me correct, I think we got a chase pack. Uh, whoo! Okay. Oh, there we go. That's gotta be a chase pack. That's gotta be a chase pack. Breaking family, nice. Okay, so the potential, the potential of a Rainbow Rare Charizard GX. <laughs> Almost said V there for a minute. GX. Highly, highly doubt it. Highly doubt it, it's gonna happen, but the po <laughs> the potential's there. The potential's there. Oh, I'm knocking knocking the camera around everywhere. There's the code card right there. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Craziness all over the place for today's Pokemon video. We got Wimpod, Togedemaru, Sock, Energy. Put it right back there in the filing cabinet. Lunatone, Gloom, Seedra, and... Slow King, hey, your buddy Slow King right there, Slowpoke. What's that? No, we're we're on. We're actually on to EXs. Yeah. No, V's are not next. It's EXs. Yeah. Yeah. What? You're you're a little behind there, my friend. But it's all right. It's all right. We're moving on to EXs. V's, V Maxes, V Stars. They're over. All right. Yeah. We're going on. Yeah. Yeah. No, you got it now. You got it. Okay, let's go into the four-pack power box. We're going to open these up here in a minute, the ones that Marie picked out. But let's figure out what exactly is inside of the Walgreens four-pack power box. Interesting. The Walgreens Pokemon four-pack power box. Once again, this is packaged by a third-party company. Ugh. Had to get my handy-dandy pen right there. You can look on the bottom of your screen, pause it, and read it if you want to. It's, I'm, I don't know if it's saying those are the ones that are going to be inside, but I guess those are potentials right there. Now, this is not classified as a mystery box, just a potential way to get some more packs. However, what was it, like $20, $25? I mean, that's, depending on what's inside, that's a little rough right there. Okay, wait a minute. Did they recycle the material from the sparkly box and put it inside of this box? Wait a minute, did they really, did they really do that? 
Oh, okay, I think they recycled the material from the sparkly mystery boxes. That's, that's actually kind of funny. Actually kind of funny. But it's good that you're recycling, all right? So, A plus for that. We got Pikachu V code card right there. Did that say anything about a code card? It did, it did. Astral Radiance is the first one right there. So, let's see. I'm, I'm interested to know the pack selection inside of these and see if it really is worth the price of, uh, of buying this. So... We got a Cyndaquil, Scyther, going into Leafeon. All right, all right, Energy, put it in the filing cabinet. Not not the best so far. It's an Evolution though. It's an Evolution. Fusion Strike is up next. Maybe Alternate Art Espeon, Alternate Art Gengar. Now, why would you say that? I haven't said, I, I haven't said any mean thing to you today. I don't know why you would come at me throwing some shade and saying, hey, I hope you don't pull anything good out of any of the rest of your packs. Now, I wouldn't say that about your Pokemon card openings. I really wouldn't. I would hope the best for you. No, no, I'm not I'm not going to fall for it. I know you want me to be rude back to you, but I'm not going to do that. Even though you're rude to me, I'm not going to be rude back to you, right? Because that, what does that do? Creates a never-ending circle of just uh, rudeness, angriness, negativity. We're not having it. We're not having it. No, well, we'll be nice back to you. Farewell, Bell. We'll put a stop to it. Stantler, Snubble, and a Gorbice. All right, all right, not not too bad. Next up, Pokemon Go. I know a lot of you have been looking for those Pokemon Go packs out there. They're hard to find. <laughs> you know what, one day, one day, we're gonna look back and go, you know what? Those Pokemon Go packs were everywhere on the shelves. I wish I would have bought more of them. I mean, are we not, are we literally not saying that? about like evolutions, XY evolutions, or anything from the sun and moon era. I mean, it, it, it could happen again. So, Meltan, Charmander, Apom, Energy, right over there. Steelix, now I gotta say, I am definitely more of a Walgreens person. I definitely think it is, uh, Walgreens definitely has a better selection of just everything in general. Um, I feel like Marie and I can go in there and just like look at a bunch of stuff, CVS, Kind of boring. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, my apologies, CVS, but it's kind of boring inside of the store. So we like to go in Walgreens and look around. I mean, they have they also have some like exclusive stuff, not for just Pokemon, but like other things as well. Um, Flyweight Bird. They also carried the Pokemon Squishmallows at one point. So I don't know. Just it could. Is it just me? Is it just me? I don't know. I feel like Walgreens is, is more fun. Oh, nice! We got the Blaziken V Trainer Gallery goodness. Whoo, okay. And a Delphox. That's not bad at all for a Trainer Gallery. <clears throat> Sleeve it up. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. I will say, the Ultra Rare VIP section looking a little uh, weak at the moment. At the moment, but we still got more. More opportunities. When we did open up the CBS packs in last week's video, uh, CBS did have a good number of Ultra Rare pulls, even though Walgreens ended up winning. So, interesting to note. There's the Mimikyu right there. There's the code card. I'm hoping that this is the one with Evolving Skies inside of it. We got Brilliant Stars to start off. I love the pack selection, if it does have Evolving Skies, that is. Code card, boom! Once again, we... We hung out while the Super Bowl was going on. I think actually while I'm recording this, the Super Bowl is still on. I've not watched a single second of it. No regret over here. No regrets at all. So, energy, it's just not my thing, all right? There's nothing wrong with it at all. I'm just saying, for me personally, just not my thing, all right? Just not into it. I'll be hearing about it for the next two weeks anyway, so I'll know everything that happens. I'm just, I was never much of a sports ball. <laughs> <laughs> the ball into the hoop, through the field goal, in the net, into the stands. I just never was much of a sports person, and I, I have no problem admitting that at all. Because there's there's plenty of things that I like that other people are not fans of, and, um, and it's just, I have no shame. I have no shame in uh, being myself, you know, and, and, and putting that out there. I'm just not into sports all that much, all right? And there's, there's no shame being yourself, all right? If you don't like sports, that's perfectly okay. If you do, that's perfectly okay as well. I mean, that's what makes all of us unique is that every single one of us is like a shiny Pokemon, right? There's not a single, 
these look weird. They, they look like uh, have extra ink on them. There's not a, there's not another person in this world that is like you. So that's always something very important to keep in mind. There's nobody else in this world like you at all. So keep that in mind. You're loved just the way you are. Evolving skies, just the way you are, all right? Don't let anybody tell you any differently, all right? We got Evolving Skies. It is the tin that I like. It is the tin that I like. It's got Evolving Skies, Fusion Strike, Brilliant Stars. Three phenomenal sets. Phenomenal, phenomenal sets from the Sword and Shield era. So, no complaints there. This was the last tin at the first Walgreens stop. So, we'll see if uh, people have been passing up a good Walgreens Pokemon tin opening. Energy. Put it right over there in the filing cabinet. We got ourselves a scroll going into, whoo, there we go. That's nice. We got a Dracozolt VMAX. Very, very nice texture. I feel like they, they've, uh, uh, the texture hasn't been as prominent lately on, uh, on, uh, the, the Sword and Shield stuff. Whoop! And the, um, Scarlet and Violet stuff, so. All right, here we go. Going into the three that Marie picked out, and then we'll see if possibly... Does CVS stand a chance? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. I'm sorry, CVS. Now, remember, we did mark these. We did put little rips right there in the top so we could tell which ones Marie picked out. These were from the middle. Let's see if she made a good choice, a wise choice. I think the end is where you need to go, though. But we'll, we'll humor Marie. We'll humor Marie. Here we go. First one, we have a Porygon, Reverse Hollow Porygon, and... The code card right there and Fusion Strike once again. Now, I don't know about all of you, but the weather has been crazy, crazy over here because it was literally like 65 degrees just a few days ago. And now we're back, we're getting like back down to the 30s again. Can somebody, can somebody please stop messing with the thermostat? <laughs> uh, I remember my, my dad would, uh, would monitor that thermostat <laughs> with a very, very sharp eye, right? He could be downstairs in the basement. Thermostat was on like the, the main level and just a little, just a little, little just move right there. Just a whoop. And he could tell, hey, did you touch that thermostat? I'm not, I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't, th what's a thermostat? No, <laughs> he could tell though. He could tell. All right, my dad, he very well knew when that thermostat got touched. I'm like, dad, I'm freezing. We got to turn the heat up here, okay? I'm freezing. And then he would respond with, I can't get this open. Not that. He wouldn't respond with that, but um, he'd say, put on your jacket. <laughs> Dad, I don't want to wear a jacket in the house, okay? Please, can we just turn on the heat, please? Uh, be honestly, he was a, a, he was, he's a fantastic dad. He's a fantastic dad. I love him very, very much. And uh, and my mother. Love my, love both my, 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 uh, my father and my mother. But I still call them mom and dad. Still call them mom and dad, all right? I don't I don't call them father and mother. Call them, call them mom and dad, all right? I love them both very, very much. You know, if it wasn't for their acceptance and their love, um, their support, uh, doing stuff like what I'm doing right now um, would have been a lot more difficult, I think. But uh, they were very loving, supportive of anything I ever, any creative endeavor I ever wanted to have in life. They were always very supportive of it. Never judged me and uh, always said that we love you no matter what. And uh, I, I always thought that that was just that. I loved, I loved hearing that. I loved hearing that. It made me feel a lot better and a lot more confident to do things. So, um, you know, shout out to my mom and dad. Shout out to Real Breaking Dad and Real Breaking Mom out there. Shout out to all the moms and dads out there. And grandmas and grandpas and uncles and aunts. All right. Marie, it's it's not looking good because I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that's a Pokemon Go pack. It is, it is. I, I would say go for the end ones, go for the end ones. The the middle ones, Marie, they weren't they weren't the best. They weren't the best. So here we go. We did get a Chase pack though. We still have our two CVS packs to open up. Going into Wimpod and a Hollow Rare Moltres Energy. Put it in the filing cabinet. There's the code card right there. Does CBS stand a chance at all? Do me a favor, hit that like button right now. I'd appreciate it. It helps out the videos. Leaving comments helps out the videos. Turning on notifications, all that stuff helps out. So anything you can do uh, like that, I'd appreciate it. But if you don't want to, no hard feelings, all right? It's all good, it's all good. Just appreciate you being here, being yourself. That's all that matters. 
All that matters is that we hang out, have a good time, being ourselves, enjoying some Pokemon, hopefully having a nice laugh along, along the way. Celebrating 10 years on YouTube this year, doing some fun things all year long. We got ourselves a cloth. Oh, energy. This is going to have to be something wild, some crazy error situation in this to really, to really be out all of that, honestly, at this point. Pokemon Go, it haunts us once again. All right, last one, Breaking Family, and this is it. Here we go. We hey, you're not my pal, Pad. Well, baby, going into Ralt, going into Torkoal, Breloom. All right, here we go. Reverse Hollow Flittle and Breaking Family. We are ending on. Can I get a drum roll, please? Thank you. And break. Oh, you a big fan of Travis Barker? All right, I, I knew you were. You're the drummer. I mean, Travis Barker, like literally one of the best drummers out there, right? You, you go into the tour this summer. I mean, we're, we'll see you there. All right, we'll see you there. We're going to be at the Indianapolis show. Maybe a couple other ones too. Maybe like, I don't know, what, maybe some Florida ones. We'll see. We'll see. All right, we'll see you there. In Breaking Family, we are in... I just had an entire conversation <laughs> that didn't include you. <laughs> we are ending on... Oh, Annihilate! Urgh. Oh, Ralph! And Arcanine! Arcanine, you didn't ruin the party, but CVS, you still lost, my friend! Breaking Family, that's it for today's Pokemon video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check the rest of the videos right over there. We'll see you all in the next video. And don't forget, I love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.